Magic fans, welcome to another unboxing video. So today we're actually going to be unboxing the uh, Dungeons and Dragons Adventures in the Forgotten Realms bundle. But when I went to my local game store, they actually had a promotion, and so for for about uh, is it like twenty five dollars uh, spend? No, no, it was like about fifty dollars spend. Uh, you get a uh, foil retro border fable passage. I think it's an amazing promotion for your LGS. Uh, my local LGS has it as one per customer, so you can only buy one. So I actually bought um, one collector's boosters of Modern Horizons two, and then two um, set booster box booster packs, which we will open before we open the bundle. Okay, so I guess let's get started first with the set booster box. Uh, set set the set boosters and see what we'll get okay so uh, diamond lion as our rare and the sign of draco mythic enchantress's presence and that's it and for our other pack we get a list card okay and glimpse of tomorrow, patriarch's bidding, <laughs> rust veil bridge, and young pyromancer for our list card. And then for our collector's booster, We get a Territorial Cavu Extended Art, then Svelun of Sea and Sky Extended Art, Blacksmith Skill, oh, and a Verdant Catacombs uh, Etch Retro Border, and a Fractured Sanity Foil. Okay, at least we got one fetch from the three packs. And I guess let's go back, go and open our, you know, main feature for today, which is our bundle. So we do get some information about what we get um, in the bundle. So it's an alternate art traditional foil treasure chest card. We have our 10 booster packs, draft booster packs, our bundle box, we get 20 foil and 20 regular basics, the three oversized dungeon cards, and the uh, oversized d20. So as always, we have this uh, extender box, our bundle. Oh, and since they're uh, pretty big, so they aren't haven't been placed inside the bundle. So as a comparison to the size versus a regular magic card. It's quite a bit bigger. I think it's a very nice addition to the bundle. There is a pamphlet or mini poster. And of course, if you open this up, let's see. We do have a bit of a, a poster thing going on. I think it, it make, might make a nice looking playmat. So uh, maybe they did have a playmat. Hmm, I don't know, actually. If you have any idea, then please uh, put a comment down below. And at least I'll find out or we'll know whether or not there's a playmat for this. Okay. And now let's get on to our bundle box. I like these boxes. This is our... It seems like more of a, uh, I guess, in between a peach and a red for the die. It's an oversized D20. Let me see if I can get... And, and this is a size comparison to the normal D20 from the PR kit. So it's about the same size as the oversized a spin down from the prior bundles, but this is a D20. That's pretty good. 
And then we get our 10 draft booster packs. And then our, our two ad cards. And, well, not ad cards, but like uh, turn steps and some mechanics of the game. And then the alternate art treasure chest plus the foil basics and the regular basic pack. Okay, let's let's see what we get from our draft boosters. Teleportation circle and a foil pixie guide. We get the Lena Wild Mage. Bard Class, Foil Brazen Dwarf. Ochre Jelly Showcase Art. You want T. Malison as our rare. And then for the last five packs of the bundle. Zariel, Archduke of Avernus, a foil choose your weapon. We get Loyal Warhound, a foil, Zariel, Duke of Archduke of Avernus. Last three packs. Dungeon Descent. Wish. And Varus Silvery Moon Ranger. So just a quick recap for what we got in the bundle. Varus, Wish, Dungeon Descent, Zerial Foil, Loyal Warhound, Zerial Regular, Yuan T, Ochre Jelly, Showcase, Bard Class, Delina, and Transportation Circle. So that's what we have for our end. And what I really like about the bundle is these, you know, big size dungeons. And of course, our, our big size spin the L. D20. Well, again, thanks for watching and let us know if you have any specific comments or anything you would want us to see in any of our future videos. We do appreciate your comments and, you know, your suggestions of content that you would like to see. And again, thank you everyone for watching and, and keeping this channel alive. So thanks again. Bye.